Hello everyone and welcome back to Civ 6 Gathering Storm where we continue in our fun little playthrough as Hungary and the Ottomans that has been quite an uphill little battle for us um, for reasons but I think we're we're slowly getting things better un under better control that's a better way to say that oh my gosh my uh, settler the place I was going to settle down, uh, Aquitaine just threw down the city exactly where I was about to put it. <laughs> Liverpool? Looking yeah. Four years away from picking that up. That's so unfortunate. That is unfortunate. This game has been, been, it's been like that. Just a little bit of... Yeah, it, I'll tell you one thing. This military victory, when we get it, is gonna feel pretty good. Yeah, I agree. The good news is, I think we're going to be able to set Poundmaker back pretty substantially. I'm going to have to burn Ravina to the ground, take Rome. Yeah, golly, boom. Rome. Why? Wow. Question is, how close am I to being able to upgrade units? What, what is that? Mercenaries? Oh, very close. Okay. Yeah. Actually, I need to go ahead and start. Oh, it's fuels first. It's mm -hmm. a, lot of, a lot of turns. Yeah. I don't need to at least get one of these. I think I'd rather spend it on this. I tell you, this is, this is. Yeah, we had, a, yeah, you had a little slow start getting your troops over here, but uh, it's gone decently well, and we have multiple. We have like five siege spots on the next city. Yeah, we do. That catapult's hitting like a truck. So Tamar made peace with Poundmaker. I mean, what did she do? Congrats on taking that, by the way. a decent little pickup and if anything it weakens old pound maker
Did you get the uh, culture bomb thing? I did. And if you take a look at Ravina, they were the recipient of a culture bomb. <laughs> oh, an important one, too. Yeah. Picking up luxuries there. Big time. Well, we have knights. What are you going up against now? Okay, well. Um, Let's just be careful. <laughs> Yeah, we do need to be careful. Um, where are my governors? Because this is just wonderful. Just let them try to come in and attack. Yeah. Would completely agree with that. I'm gonna have to. I'm God bless America. I'm gonna lose this city if I'm not smart about it. We're going to be very precise with this. Mm hmm. Okay. Yes, we are. Question is, is, can they? Kill the city. Oh, the, I think we could. That I don't know. Um, you do that. That is a very valid point. I, I think they could. But I just don't know. I really need to upgrade these guys. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff I need to do. I may let them retake this. Because we're in position to bombard. Mm-hmm. We are. And we could end up killing a knight easily. So mm -hmm. I'm going to move this guy here. That one is an, an issue. Hello, little warrior. See what happens here. Mm -hmm. Well, 
What are they voting on? Military emergency against me. <laughs> oh boy. So it's a military emergency against us. <laughs> Do an extra vote down. I didn't even have an option to vote. Which is ridiculous, but... We're gonna find out, that's for sure. They didn't go for the city. Wow. So oh! It, it passed. Pelmaker voted for it. Oh, it's Here. only... It's only Pelmaker, though. Well, that's good for Pelmaker. I guess we just now have to really win. Hello, units. Gee, Minetti. Well, huh. Three turns, you say? Okay. Can we... Ten turns. Holy smokes. Wow. All right, then. Watch out for that uh, archer, because uh, I'm backing out. Because they're, I got four units coming through the pass. Yeah. That's one way to handle it. Yeah, now I really have a secondary goal of just maintaining the emergency. Pretty much. I would agree with that 100%. Money to buy the towel that I need for my. <laughs> yeah, I've been a little cash trap. Uh, I need to have a successful next war against Rome. Big time. Feeding us kills like this, though. I do too. It would uh, make my day. Oh, praise the Lord. Finally built a road to you.
Wow. Yeah, they keep feeding us stuff. That is definitely the truth. You're like me. Yeah, we really didn't. This guy had been solid. Should be able Hey, great person. What type? Great general. Nice. She's got another knight up there. Ooh. Oh, damn. Ooh. Ooh, and he, he brought back the nasty unit. Well, that's lovely. By all standards. That's exactly what I wanted to avoid. That was... How did the... I lost an archer. Yeah, tell me about it. You lost it to that knight up there. How did he... He ran through the rainforest. They're not... They, they could do that. Apparently they can. Big time. Hmm. Well, you at least hit you at least hit that thing for for some decent damage. Let's see what that that knight ends up doing. What that knight ends up doing is going to make it hurt. Yeah, I don't disagree with that. Worry about that right there. Yep. You're completely fine. Good lord, the city has no production.
but that's okay. So, and we probably still have very little science production. Yep, that sounds about right. God almighty. Yeah, we're struggling. It's a struggle bus right now. But, did a good job holding Masky too. And we've, I mean, he can't keep up this unlimited knife production. Uh. It's been huge. Yeah, those are, they're definitely beyond beneficial. I really keep hoping that Rome is going to attack here and be the aggressor. I'd prefer them be the aggressor, but um, they may not. And I really need to take out Rome. No, it, it's imperative because they're just going to grow stronger which we don't necessarily really need happening can you hit the uh, Corsair with your archer absolutely I would love to do that. All right. Try with that back archer. Yep. Okay, all right. Well, if all goes well, I think we're not going to go into a dark age either or stay in a dark age. What am I saying? How do you go into a dark age when you're already in one? Ah, oh, we're going to have to be prepared to hit Rome hard. Which really, I mean, I've got to get these black armies. It's uh, my version of the Corsair. This guy's got two attacks. Oh, nice. Nice. Yep, that's very nice. I can live with that. All right, so we need to be building. Oh, God, that would be a perfect spot for an encampment. I hope I can get it down and get a culture bomb from it. It would be absolutely hilarious. That would be ideal. Yeah, he. you're right. He can't keep doing that. If anything, we're going to deplete his money. If he's buying it. Although, you know, I forget what the buffs are when you put the AI on Emperor. What sort of money buffs they get. 
We're also getting uh, military buffs as well. Oh, dude, no joke, man. I forgot their units hit harder. That is a very fair point. Answering a lot of emails over here. <laughs> emails, bro. We haven't discovered telecommunications. Hey, yo, swordsman time. I'm two turns away from that. I cannot wait. Whatsoever. Okay. Question is, is Cree just declared war on Rome? Interesting. England declared war on Rome. That's beyond interesting. I don't really know if I understand that, but so be it. All right. Let's do that. That'll get us some money at least. I think it's time to. Next turn, I'm going to start moving forward with what, what this uh, swordsman here. Mm hmm. Was it time for me to declare war on Rome? Time for you to upgrade this archer to a. I think, Josh, you have to send me a delegation and we have to declare friendship. I've already sent you one. Oh, if you're not able to upgrade. I got you. Got you. Because it says I'm not in friendly territory, which I should have mentioned that like, oh, 30 turns ago, but because of reasons and me being weirdo. All right, let's go ahead and I got to clear out emails myself. So Trajan's going to demand tribute. That's hilarious. Pellmaker wants peace. Not happening. All right, now let's see if that worked now. Apparently I can't declare friendship with you. Fascinating. I don't really understand that then. The only other thing I can think of is is because the AI has not ceded you that city, maybe? That's what they consider friendly territory? I don't know, I'm just guessing here. Alright, how many catapults do we have over here? Uh, not enough to knock down the walls, but... Definitely enough to cause some problems. Alright guys, we are at time. So we're going to go ahead and make a cut. I hope you all enjoyed it. And we'll see you in the next episode.